Okay, so uh, this is day two of the pit. After the debut, that was a smashing uh, failure, basically. It totally sucked uh, because of all the bugs and glitches in it. So right off the bat, I noticed something when I walked over here. Remember last night, this was all buggy. As you walked closer to it, the textures appeared. Well, it's fixed. Um, unfortunately, my last save, I was locked inside, so I can't leave to go check out all the other stuff, like the exclamation points and shit that were floating in midair. But uh, what we're going to do is we're going to try to see... Ah! Next, took all of your belongings and locked them inside. There doesn't seem to be any way to open it without the combination. Now, if you remember... Oh my god, shut the fuck up. I really want to punch you in the face right now. But anyway, that wasn't there yesterday. <laughs> that was not on the ground, so there was no way for me to even know that I'm going to get my stuff back later. Alright, so let's try to go inside and see if it loads this time. Remember last night? It did not. It just kept continuously freezing. For those of you who don't know what I'm talking about, keep saying last night, I did do a playthrough of the pit on the debut night, and it was very buggy, and uh, they actually recalled it. So go to my YouTube page and check that out. It's the uh, Fallout 3 DLC, uh, the pit buggy edition. So search for that playlist, and you'll be able to watch that whole thing up to now. There was about, excuse me, about an hour of gameplay that's not in this. Oh, look at this. I made it in, and I got the switchblade equipped. Hey ya! All right, let me put that away so I don't people don't think I'm hostile right off the bat. Oh, I got an achievement, and I got a bunch of. Uh, Your friends are dead. You're next if you don't talk. What the fuck? Huh. We can do this the easy way. Or the I break you in fucking halfway. Your choice. That's pretty mean. Fine. Have it your way. What's he gonna do? Fucking talk, you piece of shit. <laughs> oh shit. Oh! Triple ownage! He fucking killed them all. That's fucked up. Of course, it doesn't mean I'm not gonna steal from their dead bodies, but that was fucked up. Oh, none of them have anything. Alright, where's my map? Let's see. Local map. How do you get to... Here we go. Local map. Alright, my objective is to my right, and it's not generated yet, because I haven't done anything yet. Hey, man. You're an asshole. You'll walk off if you know what's good for you. What the fuck are they doing down here? Holy shit! They're chopping away! Okay, so we need to keep going this way. A mailbox. Oh. Werner sent you, didn't he? Good. He finally found someone. We can't talk out in the open like this. Meet me in my house as soon as you can. Oh we'll yeah. Talk there. Oh yeah. You'll be doing a little less talking because I'm gonna have my snake down your throat. Meet with Medea in private. Oh yes. I'll show you my privates. <laughs> what is it, Grinder? Get out of my face. Bitch. Don't look at me. The guards will suspect something at this place. Oh. I'm supposed to follow her home. Without watching her. Can I turn on the fire hydrant? Oh, no, but I can drink from it. <laughs> Kai. Yeah, what do you want? The fuck? Look at her face. <laughs> What are you doing? Shouldn't you be working or nothing? Never mind. Shouldn't you be working? I am working. You must be new here. Oh my god. I served the slob to the other slaves. Is that herpes on her you face? Is that how you're know. working? The good news is that this crap is nearly unlimited. But it's mostly radiated water and trog meat anyway. You want some or not? Give me some food. It's your funeral. Here you go. Well, why not? Just in case, right? He took my stim packs, so... 
right there she goes. Oops. A carton of cigarettes and a metro ticket. I wonder what the metro ticket's for. Hmm. Doesn't seem like I'm going to be over encumbered very often in this expansion, so I'm just going to take everything I find. I don't need those. Cigarettes. A new Coca Cola. The dinner plates fell. Why were the dinner plates on the bottom of the table? <laughs> Alright, don't ask questions. <laughs> Alright, we can talk now, but we shouldn't take too long. They saw you come in here, so they'll come looking for you if you take too long. I have a plan for getting you into Asher's palace, but we need to wait. In the meantime, you're going to have to blend in. So I just need to look like a piece of shit? Okay. Whoa, whoa, slow down. What's going on here? You're right. What can I do Does, uh, so I don't stand out? And this place is a nightmare. Let's find out what's going on here. I don't know what you saw on the way in, but the guards don't really take kindly to workers just standing around. You're going to need to look busy or they'll sniff you out pretty quickly. And if they get too close, you don't look like you belong here. Whatever it is, I can handle it. So what is it? Sounds dangerous. What will I be doing? I didn't come here to work. I came to save you all. The reward better be worth all of this. I'm going to say I came to save you all. Yeah, and right now this is what you need to do to help us. You're not really going to be much use if the guards figure out who you are and stake you out for the trogs, are you? I see your point. What do you need me to do? I'm not happy about it, but since I'm stuck here, whatever. What's the catch? Let's see. What do you need me to do? Outside the mill, <clears throat> there are a bunch of steel ingots just laying around. Every so often, the foreman puts out a work order to collect them. It's pretty much a death sentence, but they never assign it to anyone. They make us pick who's going to do it. Bastards. Let me guess, the area's full of super mutants. What in God's name is a super mutant? You know what, never mind. <laughs> Whatever enough. they are, you're wrong. What it is full of are trogs. What the fuck is a trog? Oh, it says what the hell is a trog, yeah. They're what most of us hope we never become. The contamination gets to everyone to some degree. For most people, it's some form of cancer. Sometimes harmless, sometimes not. For others, the contamination drives them insane. If it doesn't kill them, it changes them. They become animals, deformed and inhuman. It's not pretty. They're everywhere, and they oh, kill great. on And I got a switchblade. Where can I get some weapons? I'm supposed to strangle them with my bare hands? Yeah, where do I get weapons? I, I can't really help you there. Ask around. Maybe check with Marco in the mill. He's been making some of our tools into weapons. Hmm. You might even be able to find a gun on one of the dead bosses out of the steel yard. They... What was that? What's going on in here, Medea? Who is this scam? Um, nothing. Uh, nothing, sir. I, I was just telling this new worker about the job the foreman posted. You think I could kill him? Probably not. He's an NPC. Oh, yeah. So he's the one that's going out to the steel yard, huh? Yes, sir. I told him what he needs to do. He, he knows. Ten ingots. As fast as he can. Well, then. I hope you also said goodbye. <laughs> Alright, playtime's over. Get to work, grinders. It always smells like that in here. You get used to it. What a cock smoker. Oh man, everything's broken in here, huh? What's in the desk? Oh, gun rounds. So if I find a gun, I'll have some ammo. Would you get the fuck away from me, you slut? I'm trying to hump me. Uh, nothing, no books, no, uh, no bobbleheads. Not much at all. Mac and cheese. Probably all fucking irradiated. Tin plate, milk bottle. There is jack shit in her house. Why'd she get a house to begin with? Everyone else is fucked up and they're all out there and she gets a house. That's retarded. 